Hello Geek Tech Industry fans, this is uh, Zelot here, uh, coming at you from another episode of Empyrean Galactic Survival. Uh, this time I'm on our server, the Geek Tech Industries hard mode server. Um, right now it's actually live, if anyone else wants to join in, it's uh, fine, they can come and try and kill me, um, whatever, but uh, right now, last episode, um, we basically crash landed and I established myself at the bottom of a lake, picked a bunch of seaweed, smashed a bunch of rocks, got a bunch of gear and um, dug a hole in the side of a mountain. Now that was all off camera, the digging the hole, but I dug this hole. And right now um, I made all the basic items that I need for a base right now and that that's a uh, a starter block uh, use the core that I started with plus some extra materials to uh, or I think it's just the core and then it just turns it into a starter block anyway um, but uh, so I dug a little hole you can see there's the lake there there's this tunnel that I I just hung out in the lake and used my drone and drilled into the side of the hill here. Got to be careful though. There's really nasty critters crawling around this mountainside. Um, really creepy. So I built a bunch of concrete blocks out of all the stone that I gathered from the digging out this tunnel. Um, and I'm just about to lay down my, now I never did find any Promethium. So what I'm starting with is what I've got and I don't have much left. I've got about 10 um, actual cells left and I want to use that for the SV that I'm going to spawn in here and fly out. Um, so I just got to lay down some more bricks, dig this out a little bit more. Um, <clears throat> so. Let's do that. Let's equip my drill. And we're going to actually do resource mining. We'll do this. Getting stuck on rocks. Be nice when I get a T2 drill. I like that all. I didn't bring much fuel with me. That's kind of stupid. Let's just pick these up and get them out of the way. Oops. Oh, I didn't mean to use a fuel. Oh, I, that's one drawback with uh, accidentally bumping a key. <laughs> like the R key. Uh, yeah, I just wasted my last biofuel that I had on me right after I just reloaded. There you have it there. A wasted biofuel, an entire one. Uh, that's okay. I picked a whole shit ton of sea seaweed, but that means I got to go get it. So what I got on me in my drill right now is all I get. That was dirty. Oops, now let's get stuck behind my base. Is that smart? You'd be surprised at how small this SV is that I'm going to spawn. It's, it can fit through some pretty small areas. Mm, not sure if it could fit through here though. The end part might be a little narrow. I think it'll fit through here. It's going to be tight right here.
Okay. So, well, I think I'll just fill this last bit in here and start putting down some stuff. Let's see if I can bring out my drone under here. Is it going to let me? Oh yeah, nice. Okay. Now I don't have a multi-tool, so I don't want to inadvertently plunk a double block right now. It can be a re real twitchy with the drone placement sometimes. Um, you can put down blocks that you don't want to put down. Uh, should be able to put the gear in the SV should fit. Should fit. And then I won't be able to see it. Yeah. Okay. This should work. How many squares is that? One, two, three. Not enough. I need at least one more. Come on. Yes. Okay. So now, if I just drill this out a little bit here. Place this crap down, and then I'll put uh, I'll put more concrete in after. Uh, we'll seal it in after. For right now, let's do the generator. Oh, that's a little funky. What's going on there? Oh, I see. Okay, so let's get this sorted. There we go, and rotate that. That's what I need to do. Is that gonna rotate? Yes. And, okay, I'm good with that. Let's put the, let's put the um, fuel tank right there. I'm gonna move out of the way for a second here. Okay, and then, uh, you know what? I'm gonna put this right Sign it. Right there. And that leaves me room for my other stuff I want to put in there. Oxygen and a dispenser. Okay. Good enough start for right now. Um, I brought enough stuff with me. Let's put this in here. Eat some, eat some seaweed. Take some oxygen. Put all that stuff in there. Okay, and then we need to, oh, you know what we need to do? Is we need to do our tech tree and actually Take the, we'll unlock that. Uh, we'll unlock the explosive device. Probably gonna need that. Uh, the multi-tool, yes. Drill T2, of course. Uh, we don't necessarily need the texture simple tool right now, so I'm just gonna skip that for now. The cargo box, yes, because that leads to the small ammo. Uh, oxygen generator, 
Uh, hydrogen generator, we don't necessarily need that right now. Let's go on to base here. Let's do the O2 station. We're going to need a fridge, sentry gun, can of turret even, um, hangar doors. We want um, rocket turret for the base. Or do we need that right now? Let's... Um, You know what we need? We need a Gatling gun. That'll give us our 15 mil bullets. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. Let's take the armor locker, repair station, and ventilator. Micro light, oh, what the hell? Um, I should probably sink some points into these spotlights. They're really useful. We'll do minigun turret just in case. We need to. We'll, we need, we need to take a bunch of stuff here, right? So. Just in case we get damaged parts, we can at least repair on the fly, potentially. Cargo box, harvest module. That can actually potentially pick up rocks. I'd, I think I'd like to try that. Um, we'll do a con cockpit. Okay, so we're out of points. Okay, um, so now that we did that, we can go into here and we can choose our 15 mil bullets. Let's get, let's queue up 1,000, 2,000, 3,000, and then we'll go into the fuel tank. And we'll, well, we'll just put the two in there. 5%, don't know how long that's going to run for. Let's see. It says 7 hours? Oh, no. 14 minutes with the making the bullets. Okay. Okay, well, it should get through those. It should be able to make my bullets for me. That's huge. That's really huge. So we'll, uh, let's take a look and see how they're doing. Already made 300 of them. So it's pounding those off pretty good here. Nice. Uh, might as well eat that. It's not going to fill us up, so. This is huge because I already have cooked in my blueprints the Econo Claptrap uh, ready to spawn because I threw all that in there and started cooking it and uh, I, I went to bed. <laughs> Came back and it's ready to spawn. Love that. Okay. Um. Guess am I ready to do that? Yeah, I can use my. Yeah, let's do it. Let's spawn this. Let's spawn this. Let's spawn the clap trap. It... Okay, it's a little bigger than I thought. Um... Hmm. I don't want to get stuck and waste all its fuel. <sighs> How's this doing? Cooking away. It's over halfway. Okay. 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 Good to know. 
I want to turn that off right away when it's done. Um, I got to go get more biofuel too. I need to get more biofuel. I think I should go do that. Get some seaweed. I'll just jump right out, see what's out there. I didn't see anything. Okay, good. Head back down to my um, survival constructor. Um, I could probably move everything up there now. I didn't see any critters up there. This is probably a good opportunity to do that. Uh, so I think I'll do that. I'll grab as much as I can here and bring it up. Still got one, a bunch of energy going in the um, oxygen generator. I'm, I'm loath to pick it up if it still has a bunch in it because I think it wastes it. Okay, I got some good some goodies in here. Lots of goodies. So let's get all of this stuff. Um, actually, I need to make a bunch of food with that right now. And you know what? I should just... I'll be taking it with me anyway. I can make food on the actual ship with the survival constructor. So I'll just grab a blob of seaweed take it up with me into space. I'm thinking I'll go to space. Hopefully is I'll have enough power to go to space and mine a Prometheum deposit if I don't find any nearby. I mean, obviously I'm gonna do a quick fly around and check, but if I can't find any close by, I think going to space, I can conserve my energy a lot better. I can, I'll, I, I'm pretty sure Promethean spawns in the asteroid field. If not, I could strand myself and look like an idiot, I guess, but uh, nothing new. Let's just grab all this stuff here. Uh, let's just grab it all, I guess, all of it. The fuel packs, I'm going nowhere without those. My Evo boost, I'm gonna have to put that on can't forget. Um, hmm, I'm not going to be able to do this all in one shot. So, well, let's do that for now. I can take something. Uh, um, this and this. And yeah, it doesn't matter. I'm not going to be able to do it all in one shot. Okay. So, Let's head back. Now, hopefully I don't get killed on the way back with all the Promethean cells that would really suck. Although, if I'm in the water, it would be a little easier to actually retrieve, so... It's unlikely I'm going to get killed in the water, though. That's why I like actually starting in the water. It gives you enough uh, basic resources to, to give you a proper start. A good punch in the... Kick in the ass, so to speak. Okay, uh... Nice, okay, I don't see any dudes. I don't hear anything in here, so it's it's unlikely they're gonna come all the way inside here, but they may. I need to complete this base and get up a, a door. Um, but right now, we're just gonna empty the rest of this in there. Biofuel. Actually, let me take half of that out <clears throat> for fuel or for food, I should say. Uh, and the rest of them, that can go in there. And that might as well go in there. And that goes in there. That's in there. Okay, so the rest. 
Well, I don't have anywhere else to put it. Okay, so realistically, it, it's all going in there. It's just... Oops, not that. Not that. I need that. Okay. Um, well, let's queue up some more bullets then. Damn it. Well, I got energy, and I'm able to, and really I should be grabbing this stuff right now. Okay, so that's going to be 15, 3, 3,100 so far, 3,200. That should be enough right now to get me going. I need to... Uh, good enough for right now. I need to actually biofuel. Let's do the biofuel. One, two, three, four. At least. Yeah, let's do six. So that's kind of handy. The larger constructor uh, can make the biofuel. It cannot make the seaweed snacks, though. So I either have to go um, use the survival constructor uh, or build a food processor, which is right there, which I could do. I mean, I've got the resources. I can, I can pretty much build a bunch of stuff for the base right now. So let's do that. Let's get a fridge going. Let's get a food processor. Um, I could do a clone chamber if I needed to. We can do the um, an oxygen tank and O2 station. Um, oh, that means we should make a generator. So all this is going to require power, but at least it'll be made. Okay. Um, I think I'm ready. We're going to go into space here. Okay, and yeah, we'll take that with us for food. Uh, I've got enough personal bottles of oxygen to keep me going for a while. That's all the fuel we've got, so we need to find more fuel. And my drill is okay for now. It should be, it should be serviceable. I'm just going to put this in here for now. Since i got no storage yet. Nice, it's making the stuff. It's making the stuff. Woo! I'll have some gear when I get back. Okay. So let's try and get out of here. Um, we're going to fill all. Oh, 60%. Not bad. Um, I can't fill that, but I can fill all on that. 3,600. Okay. So let's see. So we'll try and fly out of here. Load the bullets up. Well, it's good to know I can get it out through here so far, because that means I could use this as kind of a, a turret. Oh, I can get out. Okay, I'm out. Okay, so let's just fly up to space. Um, I do have my evil on me, right? Yes, okay. Okay, so let's just get up there. So we can um, get off the play field before it triggers a, uh, a drone. Base attack drone. 
just had to uh, auto level there for a second. Um, yeah, I don't want to trigger an attack yet. I'm not really prepared for it, and I know it's going to be, it's like five drones every wave forever. So, uh, it's a thing. It's tough. It's a hard server. Okay, so I've got I've got some decent amount of power. 81 minutes. How much when I'm giving it some juice? 81 minutes. Okay. So Hmm. Let's take a look. What do we got here? What do we got? We've got the ring. That's where I'm gonna find all the resource. Potentially, I'm also going to have to kill some drones, so you know what, right now, I think I should get into my... Armor Locker, and equip this Evo Boost. That'll allow me to go into some really, really cold atmosphere, or some cold uh, conditions, including deep space here. Uh, the seaweed. Uh, yeah, I can just leave it on me. It doesn't matter. Okay, so we need to breathe a little bit more of these bottles. And the key is, I need to get back with enough air. Although I did keep another energy thing going on the oxygen thing, so there should be a whole bunch of small bottles at least. I don't think I'm gonna suffocate as long as I get back. I should be okay. Uh, okay, so I need to find me some Prometheum. Something bad. Let's... Page... A little bit so that I can see. I don't like the ship right in front of my view. We gotta be mindful of, uh... Of drones, too. They're gonna be out here, but I... but. I mean, that's why I made all these bullets, right? Right? Okay. So, I need... What I really need is Prometheum. I'm not sure if it spawns in here. I guess I'll find out. This could be a huge waste of my time. energy. Gotta look out for uh, drones. Don't want them sneaking up on me, especially while I, if I find something to mine. It's probably completely on the other side of the ring where all the spawns are. Isn't that like the most likely spot? The furthest? The furthest possible? When you have the least the least amount of fuel to um to to waste. I don't even see any resource asteroids at all. Like oh shit. Multi multiple bogies. Are they both coming at me? Let's back up here. That guy's backed off. Okay, let's go after this guy. Let's go. He's hiding behind the rock, really? Really, here he comes. Here he comes. I knew he was shot. Lag shot. So I jumped up a bit there. Let's just jump over 
really quick. Put my jack on, okay, F, and F, and oh yeah, some real goodies. Some, oh, excellent stuff. Wow. And we gotta go, because we got another one coming right at us. Did you see that? Jesus. Holy. That was crazy. shots. Okay, space is dangerous. Space is very dangerous. Whew. That was freaking close. As I'm looking at one, all nervous about it, looting his buddy, he comes up <laughs> from nowhere Got a hit in too. The bastard. Okay. Lesson learned. But I know I won't learn. So let's jump out and do it again. Well, thank you for your bits. Your very nice, tender bits. Okay. Okay, let's get. Where is that last guy? There's one more that was pestering me. Where did he go? Where did you go? Which way was I going? Okay, so there's... There's the Mato, so I must have been going this way. Okay, so let's keep going that way. Crazy, crazy how far off track a dogfight can take, take you. It's a little wild. I don't know where that other one went to, but he's out here somewhere. Come on, Prometheum. I need Pro... Oh, what's that? What's that? There's a... There's a... Satium. Well, that's good. That's not what I'm looking for. Um, I'll mark it. Okay, so let's get in here and spin this around and we'll waypoint that, yes, okay. ring spawns Prometheum. It's like one of those real basic, like, nothing spawns except for Prometheum. <laughs> um, yeah. I mean, I could be deadly wrong, though. And I could prove to be deadly if I use up all my energy looking for it. see another Sathium. Oh, and uh, what do we got coming in? We've got we've got Charlie coming in here. Oh. Where did he go? Where did he go? I don't know where he went. Okay, well, let's go mark this. So, another Sathium. I mean, I should jump out and mine some, but I just... If it was Neo, I might. 
Although I did pick up some uh, advanced CPUs, which will, will allow me to make a um, T2 drill when I get back, which I'm excited about. That's going to make uh, make it easier. Oh, there's a dude. Hey, dude. I won't kill you. Take your bits. Oh, and what is that? What is that? Is that? Oh, it's Neodymium, which is nice. And we're going to get a lag shot right now. all around where, where where's this going he's coming at me he's coming at me hard so we've got to take him out Another one? Where's that other one? Is he coming at me? Is he coming at me? I don't think so. Okay, let's get this dude's bits really quick then. Wow. Wow. Seven, seven power coils already. This is, uh... This is awesome. Awesome. Okay, let's let's see if we can get this guy before he despawns. And this guy coming at us? Is he coming at us? Nope. Okay, okay. Let's Oh, and there's another guy. Can I do this quickly? I don't know. These guys are an awesome uh, way to get some really high-end resources in the game. Um, if you ever have an opportunity to to hunt a a ring like this, do it. Because as you can see, you know, well that guy not so much, but but you know the other one so far is you know advanced CPUs and power coils. Wow. Flux coils aren't, aren't so shabby themselves. I'm going to need all that stuff to make some CV parts or to be able to spawn a CV in anyway. Okay, so now I need to mark this Neo. Um, 87 minutes, so 110. Okay, so I really need to find some Promethium. Dude, is that a dude? No, that's a dead dude. Dead dudes. Okay. Okay. So I think I can quickly mine some of this. I've got enough to do this. Let's get some of this here. We're gonna look for multiple moving red bogies. So 
Resource mining. It's kind of funny doing a T1 drill in space. It really sucks. This is kind of boring. Um, so I think so far so good. We got the base up and running. We got the SV going. I'm in the process of mining some Neo, which is pretty awesome. Uh, we still haven't found any fuel though, and time is ticking. So uh, I think I'm going to, uh, off camera, I'm going to scout around and try and find some Prometheum. I might have to land and I might have to go on planet and just like ditch my SV or something before it runs out of fuel. That that could be tragic, but uh, um, you know, if that's, if that's what it is, that's what it is. But I think for now we'll leave it at this episode. Uh, out in space, me out there mining some Neil. Um, so guys, why don't we see you next time and Hopefully I can get like an HV up and going, a uh, mining HV if I if I do find some Prometheum and we can uh, really get some good resources and and be much faster on our way to spawning a CV. So, okay guys, you have a good night and uh, I will talk to you guys later. Ciao!